What is up, beautiful people of YouTube? My name is Jurtastic, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Tropical 6 Sandbox Gameplay on our money island here, Capitalist Island, that we're doing. Play it off camera just a little bit, just kind of at the beginning stages. I don't want it to be too repetitive, too boring, so I'll go briefly what we talked about. We had a few demands from last episode. Uh, this was one of them, the Conventello. Uh, we built a fire station. I'll tell you why in just a second. A fast food joint was another command. This was not a command, but I built it because it was needed as a clinic, and we built another MBC. Uh, besides that, these are the main things, and of course, we've done some awesome trade deals to almost get us back to the money we started to be when we were, when we started this island. Now, the reason there is a fire station because, unfortunately, I'm not sure why, uh, rebel threat is high, and we've been attacked by the gorillas three or four times, and you know, it's the buggy attack, the annoying attack that we discovered last season where the gorillas really don't do anything they come attack you then magically disappear and teleport uh, so things have been starting to burn down they attacked the cigar factory twice they attacked the botanical garden once uh, and they attacked this construction office once not sure why rebel threat is high that's exactly what i was telling you guys last episode i played this game too many times i know that once you start in a cold war in internal or, or internal policy internal politics is going to be a little challenging because they're going to expect way more and that's exactly what's going on right now that's why we're getting guerrilla attacks i'm not sure about the guerrilla attacks uh, i know i'm not sure about the rebel attacks or the rebel threat either because we haven't really took anything which kind of tied my hand and forced me to add a barracks which i wasn't planning on adding anytime soon but that's where we're at right now the guerrilla attacks are knowing something we have to deal with now building a hospital is one of my missions this episode but that requires electricity uh you know what's been kind of helping me a lot with the money is these cars deals that keep coming uh, lower and lower so 16 percent below standard uh, is gonna suck some money out but it's gonna give it back to us and we're gonna make 16 percent profit on this uh, 8500 units of um of of cars that we're we're exporting or we're importing from from the eu so besides that let's get it started i hope you guys are having a wonderful day as always oh and one more thing the tourists visited is uh, our our uh task to advance the modern times right now i'm not in a rush to advance the modern times so i'm gonna chill on that a little bit we'll have it right there it's probably gonna be more more tasks anyways because that's usually how it is they give you the first task you get it completed then i say okay do the second task oh and we built a embassy to invite the eastern block right now so that's about it so let's get it started oh we're almost done with the uranium as well so we're obviously trying to calm down a little bit with the bs um bs uh gorilla attack so we're trying to kind of give them what they want as much as we could right now uh, i think one thing is probably going to help us is a church uh, it's gonna cost us around seven thousand sixty eight hundred to just build it with the blueprint and the build so we're going to build a church that's gonna satisfy their religious needs um, I think that could be another reason not really sure like I said why they're attacking so much so early we're literally in the second episode uh, if you look here rebel attacks cigar factory twice potato garden once uh, and uncovered rebel it's a, it's at a high rate but those are just the uncovered ones so we're not sure exactly what's going on with that uh, another thing with that we do need to build this this episode is a high school and possibly a library to start generating some uh some points so let's go ahead and do that as well right now because eventually we're going to need the high schoolers and and this is why it's always beneficial to start a colonial era because by the time you get to the time where a lot of high school jobs are open you already have a lot of high school educated people but in our case we don't have that so that was that was a, the challenging part that i wanted to challenge myself with this episode is kind of jump in in cold war where there's going to be more and more demands for us so uh oh god there's gonna be a lot of money oh well it's gonna, it's gonna need to happen anyway so let's go ahead we're only getting one anyways so it shouldn't be that big of a deal right now and here we go so we got a church and a high school built up here let's take a look at this one highs and fish so not looking good for the next ship that's coming in not looking good at all uh, only 787 dollars 787 come on ship come on going 
Uh, but the cars came in. See, the expected revenue from cars is gonna drop or balance. It's gonna pick it up, drop or balance, pick it up. It's gonna, it's gonna happen. So you kind of going low and then on it, but I'll deal completed Always with this. Okay, with 2,000 Swiss bank. I'll take that. Sooner or later, we're gonna need the Swiss bank. Uh, and how much is a library? Because uh, I'm gonna need that as well. A uh, library is going to cost us 3,600. Needs two high school educated people. I don't think we have that right now. Anyways, unemployed citizens are. Oh, we have one high schooler, but they might take the high school job, which is more beneficial for me right now. That's 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 how you get more high school people. So there they are. It's built. Well, let's see. Hopefully, somebody works in here. There you go. That's the high school worker, as expected. Uh, all right. This one. Don't tell me that they need high school people too. Do they? Oh God. Yeah. Education required high school. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and raise the budget on this so we can have the high schooler, high school workers come here. I had to hire the two uh, college-educated workers for this one, uh, so that's that's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. Uh, how about a, a homeless? Not too many homeless. We can go ahead and build one more house here. Kind of just slowly but surely putting more and more houses here. There we go. Put a little nice, little nice. Uh, park here there we go this island that i want to that i care about i like the other island we played on so whenever i get a chance to beautify it a little bit see like rebel threat is high and like i said guys i'm not exactly entirely sure why that is to be honest with you i mean we're we're not doing anything to piss them off so not sure about that one the citizens are demanding election and here we go election time it seems that they want a choice in how they um, are ruling. so selfish dang this is a hard hard one this is a very, very hard one. Um, so we're going to go ahead and deliver. Because I don't want to do it's not a good time. Because we already have rebels waiting to cut our heads off. Uh, but at the same time. Oh boy. I'm going to I'm gonna go ahead and do it. I'm going to go ahead and do it. The hell with it. Uh, we're going to go ahead with faith happiness. Healthcare happiness. We're going to go ahead with healthcare happiness. That's we're gonna acknowledge. We're gonna praise the capitalists because that's our main people right now. And we're gonna not blame nobody. And we're gonna improve or or promise to improve the healthcare happiness because we're gonna hand in hand with the at sixty six percent. Okay, so they like the fact that I did a speech. Once again, all right. Way to cut me off, dude. My own assistant is cutting me off for my speech. There is where he normally do a speech, but but we can't. So have a security checkpoint. I don't know about that one, man. I'll take it, but I don't know. We can just do it and take it out, I guess. Dang, I kind of wanted to listen to the first speech ever, but I guess we're not doing that. Um, he has he needs a, he wants a security point somewhere around here. I mean, we can put that. It is what it is. Why is it so much to unlock a blueprint for a dang security point? Whatever. Again, it's one of them things is like you're gonna some time, there it is, you know. I'm, not I'm sure actually gonna take the ten immigrants this time. I am going to take the ten immigrants because we need workforce right now. Alright, one kid in school. That's not good. <laughs> what is this? Why would you attack a school? See, like okay, here's what I'm talking about in case you watch it. So they attacked it, they're gonna go, they're gonna go, and then they're gonna disappear. Nope, they've teleported out. It's so annoying. And plus, why would you attack a high school? Like, that's slow. Especially there's one kid in there. So that's that's what I don't get about this. What's going on right now. But usually. In case you haven't watched it. Usually he'll be talking here. And there'll be people hanging around here. In, the, in front of the palace. Listening to El Presidente. Spread his propaganda. I'm glad we took the the option to to have an election then. Because that raised us up a lot. Because you know 65% and 35%. So that raised us up a lot. All right, so if we're gonna have to start doing electricity, we better start getting a coal mine because that's the first one we're doing. So let's see where do we have coal around here. Obviously, there's one here. Man, this one is very, very far. I'm not even sure because I usually like to put them next to each other. Uh, I guess we're gonna have to go with the electric substation for this one. But let's go ahead and put it here. Um, boom, boom, boom. It's actually not a bad idea that it's far away from from uh, the main or where people are living. I guess I wouldn't call it main yet because it's not nothing serious so here's that and yeah, let's go ahead and get a street going that way uh, we're gonna have to kind of make it janky well, we can go this way i guess 
All right, and once that gets built up, we'll go ahead and start building the uh, the power plant or the coal. It's gonna be the coal one. I believe it's gonna be the coal one. It's gonna be just a regular power plant. Um, mm hmm. Yep, it's gonna be just a regular power plant. Okay, now for the Pirate Cove missions, we're gonna go ahead and risk rescue many. This is gonna be our first one, and we'll just go ahead and rescue. I mean, get some other loot. Uh, we gotta rescue many because, like I said, we need workforce. We got 26 vacant jobs that are just hanging around. So, hopefully, we get some people in here that can fill them up for us. It um, really pisses me off with the gorilla attacks. It's just, it's just very annoying. It's new to Tropical Six. Uh, I don't want to keep complaining about Tropical Six because, uh, you know, I don't want to just seem like I don't like the game. I love the game. Obviously, I wouldn't do it, but uh, it's just some things don't make sense in it, and that's one of the things. It's like, what? Why? So. It is what it is, I guess, right? It is what it is. So let's go ahead and build a little country house here. Trying to just expand to the areas where we don't want to flat out put a tenement or a house. Just put a little country houses. Actually, right here is going to be beneficial because we are going to have people here. So there's that. Waiting for the next ship. Of course, a lot of money, but that's because we have the cars. But once the cars, we're going to have more cars get delivered, so... We'll see how much actually out of 34,000. We're at 110 right now. Come on, let's go. I like I like to look at stuff like this. So, so about 15 because the cars came in. So 15,000 in profit. That's that's not bad. High rebel threat once again. Not sure why. Not sure why. I'm waiting for it to tell me what health happiness they're expecting out of it. Um, so that's kind of why I'm preparing a power plant because the hospital obviously requires electricity. Should we start hiring? Yeah, I'm going to start hiring from the outside. It is what it is. It is what it is. It's needed. It is definitely needed right now. So there it is. And the country house is getting built. From the palace cool. Says, there is nothing to be alarmed about. This sense of growing dread is perfectly normal. Okay. Everyone what is this? Friends, Produce right? uranium. Alum no. Nah. Right right? I don't know if I want to do aluminum. I don't like to s exploit all my resources like that, but I'll go ahead and accept it. Just put it in the back end. I don't really like to export them this early, especially if I'm not using them for the city. There isn't a good trade deal on for them, but like something like this, I can probably handle. It is what it is. It has jobs, but we're going to wait before we build that because I don't have nobody. So what am I going to build a building for that nobody's going to be working in it? So... That's kind of what it is. State approved doctors. Gonna have to do the research and all that. Um, with that being said, let's go ahead and just pull the trigger on the library. Or, uh, yeah, the library is gonna be 3,600. There's not gonna be any people working in it, unfortunately, but it is what it is. Uh, we'll, we'll figure it out after that. So, here's the library. Go ahead and build it up. Would somebody live in this country house? Okay, so they did. I'm assuming maybe people will live in this one as well. Not yet. Okay, interesting. So we got people coming in, people coming out. That's how you do it. Money-wise, we're doing exactly what we need to do. Usually, it's very, very rough at the beginning stages, but it's um, we're doing what we need to do money-wise. We are doing what we need to do. And as always, ladies and gentlemen, if you're new to the channel, this is what I do. I do different tropical 16th island. We did a regular one where everybody was happy, successful economy. We did a military dictatorship last time where we just try to see how long we can last with a military dictatorship. And this island is the money island in Tropical 6, the capitalist island of Tropical 6, if you will. So it's all about them making the money, and it's all about pleasing the capitalist faction, if we could, which so far, as you can see there, the faction is the happiest with, the, with us. So, uh, finish, no. I don't know about this one, man. I'm, I'm going to have to take the negative, uh, the minus five alliance with you guys. So I don't know about that. I'm not going to piss nobody off just yet. You know, I'm not going to piss nobody off just yet. I'm going to go ahead and take this out. We're done with this. It was just for the... It was just for the task that we had, which we got already. So, there's that. And once again, I come and burn out of high school. It's just so stupid. It's just those gorilla attacks. Are, I'm, plus, I'm at 64% rate, like, approval. Like, wh what? what is this for? Is this going to keep happening? Is this, like, a new bug in Tropical? Or, or what? what is going on with this? Uh, what is going on? I don't know. I don't know. I'm over it. We're just going to have to deal with it as it comes along, I guess. But I'm over it. So that's good right here. This country house is filled up. I'm just wondering why this country house should have some people. I mean, they live right here. Okay. Well, with that being said, are they starting to produce coal? Uh, not yet, apparently. We're going to go ahead with profit protocols. Got to decrease their job approval a little bit. But at the same time, it's going to go ahead and hit this. 
uh, same time is gonna um, in increase the productivity in here so in this case let's go ahead and just pull a trigger on this power plant is gonna cost us 15,000 to build uh, well it's a necessary necessary evil if you will I'm trying to get it as close to the to the mine as possible and as close to the city as possible so go ahead and put it right here and we'll just make a little street for it there you go go ahead and start building them up boys go ahead and start building it up once again don't worry about the zoning of things right now we will go with that later I'm thinking if we had more more people I would definitely build a uh, a um, teamsters office because they, they can always be can always be good so efficiency is decreased 25 while the building is operational no we don't want anything increases efficiency by 25 percent that's one thing I'll take so now we're starting to regenerate some points not really enough at all but some points let's take a look at edicts we're not not too many of them are going to be unlocked just yet because we're still going at it but we have happy me tax cuts social security um probably do mandatory waste sorting so they're made in tropical increases the export of prices uh increases the upkeep of industrial buildings by 20. so that could be a good one especially if we're thinking about making money Agriculture subsidies increases the efficiency of our agriculture. I can't speak. Our all agriculture buildings by 25%. Increases the upkeep of those buildings by 50. God dang. Increases capital standings by 10. We don't want to decrease anything capital. So we'll put that. No free lunch. Citizens need to pay one dollar whenever they take food from a production or industry. Broke citizens cannot afford to pay f to buy food. Uh, decreases comedy standings, but increases capitalists. Remember, we're all about the capitalists. Whatever it is to make us money, that's what this island is for. Oh, I dropped me 5%. Maybe I should have waited after elections. Maybe I should have waited after elections. Dropped me 5% in approval rating. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That is not good. Here comes a ship. Come on, pick up our stuff. Of course, that's... The good citizens of um... Vote for you, Presidente. I myself intend to... Dang. No, I allowed him to vote freely. I'm going to take the risk. I am going to take that risk. It's a pretty close election, but I am not gonna do anything funky just yet. Is this even built up yet? No, they're still working on it. It's a big building. It takes a while to build up. But yeah, I just took the risk, man. I really did. That one was a risk. Okay, let's take a look at stuff. We can start having a hole. I'm gonna go ahead and make it tropical. That's the first one I'm gonna do. Uh, alternative food source, that's a good one. Immigration is another one. So we'll start off with these simple ones for right now. Of course, they're still getting researched because we still have that. Nice to meet you. Okay. I have $2,000, which doesn't really... Uh, I, could get, I could take the motel blueprint because we're going to need it. So I'll go ahead and do that. Do the motel uh, blueprint. So once again, I'm not really rushing or am I stalling having tourism. I'm just trying to figure out the, the simple things. Homelessness is pretty good. It's pretty good. It ain't bad at all. How's the cigar factory? Cigar factory is doing good. We do have a cigar and a rum deal. Let's take a look where we are with those. Uh, rum is we're almost there. About about fourteen hundred units left, and cigar about the same. About let's say two thousand units left. So we're almost there with that one. This one we have a few more loads of it. Um, where we do it now? Remember again, it takes money away from us. So if you take a look at expenses or revenue. Uh, expense is going to be import and imports obviously going to be cars but at the same time if you take a take a look at export export is cars so uh although we spent forty seven thousand on importing the cars where we made 55 so that's about eight thousand dollar difference uh or profit that we've made so far so that's pretty good that's pretty pretty good let's go ahead and start look at another industry once again what's holding me up from more industries is the fact that we don't have the workforce right now for it but I think there was something here that it, that's why I didn't build it. Let me take a look. Like some resource. I forgot which one it was. Uh, oh, well, so it's over here. So we don't have to worry about that because we're building it here. Okay. Maybe thinking about doing a creamery. Let's go ahead and do that. And a creamery. So we're going to obviously need cheese. I'm going to need some of that cheese. Mmm, milk. I just want something gives me milk. Goats. Mmm. So if I put it here, the efficiency is a little down. 
It is what it is, though. Well, you know what? I'll just make it like this. We'll just make the block like this, then. No problem. Let's go ahead. Come on. I'm trying to build a street. There we go. Now, I generally don't like just block after blocks make it look too much of a city but um, for right now it'll do what we need it to do a ranch and we're gonna go with goats for the milk and we're gonna go get, get a couple of them going and here's the second one and we're gonna go ahead with the uh, creamery it's uh i don't really do this usually off the bat because i don't have the workforce for it but i'm i'm Probably gonna just start hiring people from the outside. Are you guys almost done with your mission here for rescuing many? Are they done already? I don't know. But there's 10 people that came in, so that's good. So that's very good. So this is done. This is built up. Great. Good to hear. Uh, we are still gonna obviously need people to work at it. Getting built is one thing, but people working it is another thing. Go ahead and just raise the budget up a little bit. Hopefully they come and like it. How was the church? Church is, of course, good. And high school is not that good. Anybody graduated yet? No. The poor people, they keep getting, keep getting attacked by, by annoying gorillas. So, oh, it's not really a landslide. Yeah, I don't know about a landslide, Penultimo, but 58%. I'll take that. Uh, everything's gonna stay the same. So I'm not gonna change anything with that. Everything's gonna Contact. stay the same. Comrade Here, build a hospital near the Eastern Block Embassy. I will do that because I'm, I'm thinking of building a hospital. So I was thinking of putting it somewhere around here. So I'll, I'll take that one. I will take that one. No problem. We're just winning. I know you always keep oh, have a, okay. So I'm only two away. I love it. I love it. I might have actually fulfilled the campaign promise for once because it is harder than, than it looks. So let's take a look at the hospital, which I believe is going to be around 20 Gs to build. Uh, we'll wait for this ship to come, which is coming in one month, and we'll build the hospital after that. Of course, we're going to have 5,000 from the religious people themselves uh, for building that hospital. So let's take a look here. Uh, toy workshop. That's, that's a new one. That is a new one. Huh, nice. Okay. See, they're still adding things onto it. Smart furniture studio. That's a new one, too. I like that. I like that. Good job, Tropical Calypso. You guys are... You guys are not forgetting. You guys are adding stuff without a DLC. You got to love that. Good job on them. Uh, let's see. Hospital is going to cost us. Oh, it's not as much. Not a, not a, not the, certainly not the, <laughs> the 20,000 I thought. We're going to build a newspaper and put that to make money. Uh, it's not really expensive. The only thing is it will take, it will take a high school people to run it. So here we go. I will just put that there. Let's get ready for the hospital here pretty soon. Can I put it here? Would that be in your radius? I guess so. I kind of want to put it here, but it doesn't fit what I'm thinking about because, you know, embassy, embassy, hospital. I mean, it isn't a prime area, but fast food is not really doing that good. How much money have we made? We didn't make any money. We're losing money. $320 since we built it. Here comes a the ship. There you go. 100, 107 thou. We can ask for financial aid pretty soon, can we? Two months and two days. Okay, so that's good. That's good. Of course, financial aid does decrease your standings with whatever political power you're asking it from, but it's a necessary evil in my opinion. So here's the hospital. Let's see. Let's make sure. Let's, yeah, I'll put it this way. So there's the hospital. It's right next to the embassy. So that will make him happy as well. So we're kind of getting... Kind of trying to make our money back so we can get 5,000 or 4,000 Swiss or 10 immigrants from them. So if we win the money route, we'll get 10,000 from them, 10,000 from the religious community. And that's uh, 5,000, 5,000, man, that's 10,000. So so we'll be we'll be in good shape there. We'll be in great shape there as well. Uh, let's see. There's this on yet. Oh, already having coal. And it's already at maximum capacity. I love it. So electricity-wise, we should be good. We might need a power substation. Oh, yeah, we got to need a few of them, actually, not just one. Oh, boy. I just didn't want it too close, uh, but it is what it is. Let's see. A warehouse stores a massive amount of up to three different goods, a lot of customization, logistical guidelines. Oh, my God, dude. I like this new stuff they're adding. I might have to do an episode on this for you guys. 
It's just like all the stuff that they've added. Because that is pretty cool. Actually, I might just do a warehouse, to be honest with you. That is really, really cool, dude. So, we have people in a creamery. That is great news. And we have people in the ranches. Oh, man. We still have about the same amount of jobs, but that's a lot of high school peep peeps. Um, so, Power Plant Cigar Factory and a newspaper. I think as a newspaper, honestly, it's like very, very low budget. Yeah, here it is. That's why. So, we're going to go for a penny saver. You earn $5 for each citizen living in the vicinity every time they rest. Uh, decreases liberty. Liberty. Um, the dependent. What is it? Decrease of liberty. I knew I could. Oof. Should we get that religious stand? I will take the five. This channel immediately. And the code word is borscht. We have 20 seconds from now. We'll take the 10, 10 immigrants. So we took five and took the 10 immigrants, and, and that should also help us with our our campaign promise, which we're gonna actually fulfill for once. We're gonna fulfill the campaign promise for once. I'm very, very happy about that. This, this is a really great episode. I'm loving this episode so far. I hope you guys are enjoying it as much as I am. But we are doing some some great, great work here. We are doing some great, great work. And I mean, you can't really be can't really be too happy about a second episode island. Oh, we fulfilled the campaign promise, dude. I have. Oh my god, that's so cool. I think they fixed that too because I felt like that was a little too much. I felt like that was a little too much. So this has been built. Let's see where does electricity reach now. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. You couldn't really. We're off to a great start. We are really off to a great start. I kid you not. But except this BS. But I mean, it is what it is. Got to take the good with the bad. Got to take the good with the bad. So now the aluminum, we can go ahead and start doing it once we get those ten, ten immigrants in, which the ship is coming pretty soon. Uh, 29 days and we can ask for financial aid. I think the East Western powers like us so much. It's probably not going to decrease. Oh, it did decrease at this time. It is what it is. 20,000. It is what it is. I'll take that. I will take that for sure. Maybe this is when the car deal is going to be done. Once the car deal is done, we'll just go ahead and take something else. Oh, it's not done yet. Okay. So we're, we're hanging around the 100,000. We're not really obviously going up in money as much, but look at all the stuff that we built. In that sh little short period of time. So that's very, very good, man. That's very, very good. <laughs> I'm liking it. Oh, hospital got people in it. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, we're going to start hospitalization wing. Hospitalization wing. <laughs> okay, go ahead and get with that as well. Uh, the clinic is doing good. State approved doctors. That's good. Uh, this is probably not going to make us money just yet. Because we need to research. We can go with the penny saver. I don't know why it decreases liberty by five. It is what it is. I'm, I'm taking that. If it's going to make me money, I'm taking that. Remember, our goal is to make money. And if it makes some people upset, then it is what it is. We got homeless citizens, some more of them. Let's go ahead and get them a tenement. We haven't really built housing recently. There you go. That's cool. That's done. This block is over with. We can go ahead and try to... Unify it a little bit, not really too much or too crazy. Uh, let's go like this. There we go. Just a little bit. We don't want to fill it all the way up just yet because we don't have that kind of money. And here we go. We're still starting to have more students here. I like it. This church is doing good. I like it. Uh, go ahead and up there. There. Uh, decreases the visiting time. Let's go ahead and get that as well. Even though we're, we're not really at full capacity in it, I guess. This tropical island is not um, is not a uh, as religious as my other ones. See, another thing, if you start in, uh, start in Cold War, I guess they don't give you a, a chapel. Because they usually give you a chapel. But we can go ahead and build one since they're not really that expensive to build. 1700 We could build one like a little far away for the people that can't go over there. Go ahead and build it right here. So, for, so people could have options. I don't really like it when it's at a... Uh, at a stretch like that. Uh, let's see. Maybe we can build it right here. Yeah. It's a little tucked away, but it is what it is. How's the creamer doing? It's not really producing anything because it keeps getting freaking burnt down, man. So this is a lot. It's doing milk. It's doing milk. So this is good. That's good. I love it. I love it. I love it. We are doing great. The hospital's good. Yep. The hospital's good. We are doing great. And we have 20 people that are coming in. Maybe once the economy starts picking up, they'll start doing that. Um, 
So that's very, very good news. But with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, we accomplished a lot this episode. We've on damn near wiped out all the demands. We had aluminum. Uh, it's something we're waiting on to get more more workers, which looks like the vacant jobs is going down. So that's good. And the tourists visited, like I said, multiple times this episode. We're not really in a rush because that's our first task to advance to modern times. But let's go ahead and just dab our feet in um, the Cold War era a little bit. Uh, rebel threat is still high. Not sure why rebel and guerrilla attacks are just coming in really, really unconventional ways. Not sure why, but it is what it is. This is not really empty in stock. Why are you guys empty in stock? Come on, guys. Come on, repair. I'm gonna go ahead and raise your budget for the tobacco. I need you guys to chop chop a little more. Need you guys to chop chop a little more. Let's wait for this ship to be done and we'll go ahead and wrap up this episode while it comes in. With that being said, ladies and gentlemen, it is always an option for you to like this episode. If you enjoyed it, that would help me out tremendously. Like you guys see, I do my best to give you guys the best audio and video, the best commentary possible. And then give you something that's entertaining to watch within Tropical and something different. And if you're new to the channel, always a good idea to hit that subscribe button if some, that's something you'd wish to do so you never miss an episode of mine. With that being said, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Jurtesic. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. And I am... Out.